Hi everyone, welcome back to the Chan. Currently, my room is a state. Long story, I'll talk about it during the time lapse, but I figure if I need to clean my room, I might as well make some content out of it. Let's get started and I'll tell you the story while I'm cleaning. Okay, so first of all, here's an overview of what my room looked like before I started cleaning. This is actually so embarrassing and I can't believe I'm even putting this on the internet. If you can't tell or if I haven't mentioned, my room's the attic, so if there's any kind of critter that makes its way up there, it's more likely to be in the attic than anywhere else in the house, I feel like. So anyway, there was a bat in my room and my sister and I couldn't sleep up there for like two weeks. So those doors that you see on the wall, those tan ones, those are actually closets that run the entire length of the house. And that's where we keep all of our like attic storage stuff because obviously the attic is occupied by a person. And so unable to look for the bat because it disappeared and we couldn't find it, we had to take everything out of all of those storage spaces. And then also we had to like destroy everything looking for it. So that is why my room looked so horrible. Hi, it's the next day. I look like a little boy right now and my air conditioners might be a little loud, but we're gonna deal with it because that's just the vibe of this vlog. Well, my camera died and I kept cleaning, so I pretty much got all of the bins out of here and then I started putting my like closets into the actual closets. My dad installed this rod so I could like hang my clothes up. So I started to put my like hanging clothes in here because I actually don't even have that many clothes to begin with. And then I put my extra hangers down there because um, I do have a lot of laundry that I need to put away because I haven't been able to put away because my room's been a mess and I haven't even been sleeping in my room. So I think the way I'm going to tackle this today is I'm just going to try to get all of the little stuff off the floor and then get the clothes all sorted. So I'm just going to put you back on time lapse and hopefully you enjoy the progression. Oh my god, I feel like this light is making my sunburn worse. Yikes. Oh wait, what's your name again? Wait. Hey, Dex. Okay, hi. It's been like half an hour, I think, because the time lapse just shut off, but I've made quite a bit of progress. It looks so good from this angle, but like, once I turn the camera, you'll see there's even more. I feel like I've just been like moving mess to other piles, but so like I just did a room tour a couple weeks ago or like a couple months ago or something. I like can't keep track of time anymore, but um, I had my closet set up right here with room dividers. And so my mom just, she took the room dividers. So I'm obviously upset that I can't have my closet anymore, but I have no idea what I'm gonna do this space now. Maybe I'll make like a cute little filming area, but also the room dividers kind of divided my room and my desk area. So like my desk is right here and it just like, looks like it's in the middle of my room now but that's a whole mess too i like can't even edit or do anything because this is my computer that i edit on and i clearly can't do anything because there's all kinds of stuff all over here and it's also a lot of stuff that i haven't seen in like years because they were all in these closets and i love my room so much because i love it how big it is and how open it is but at the same time i have zero storage somebody's calling me please hold i'm probably just gonna i don't even know uh Hi, it is now, I guess, day three of this little cleaning adventure. The sunburn's not looking great today. Also, I have no idea what's happening there, so we're just gonna pretend that that's not a thing. An update, I guess, I cleaned. So I, I went to my friend Megan's house last night and watched Hamilton, which by the way, 10 out of 10 was amazing. But I got home at midnight and I couldn't sleep because I had some caffeine late, which was a bad decision on my part. But I did some more cleaning. I was gonna vlog it, but my sister was sleeping. We share a room, so I didn't wanna turn on a bunch of lights to film. So I think I got it on the vlog, but I pretty much cleared out everything. Well, I did clear out everything in this area. The only thing I didn't move is those dog beds because those dog beds usually go at the base of my bed. But as you can see, I have a lot of clothes here. So these clothes are all going in this closet. I think I showed you in that closet yesterday, but this closet's more for like my folded clothes. And then I have some like memory boxes over there. But, oh my gosh, it's so dark. You probably can't even see this. So another thing I did yesterday, hello, if you could please focus, that'd be absolutely divine. This was like a mound of stuff. I pretty much cleared all of this off. And the plan is I want to flip this around. So like the drawers are over here. Put the room divider on this side and then put this empty bookshelf that I was using for like clothes and stuff 
on this side too to make kind of a divide between Daphne's room and my room. I have to put my bed skirt back on. I use like my loose sheet, my top sheet, to use as a bed skirt because I don't like the way this looks at all when it's like naked. So I have to take my whole mattress off and that's a real process. So that'll probably be the last thing I do. But goal for today, clothes, desk, computer setup. Update, the cat is now up here, so I'm not gonna vacuum anymore. It's also been a couple hours I vacuumed and then I went and got something to eat because my attention span's approximately this big. But I guess I can show you the cat because I haven't showed the cat at all. Come here. This is our cat, Fergus. He's on crack right now, but he do be cute. Say hi. Hey. Did you just see me get rejected? So this is why I'm a dog person. They give you unconditional love. I'm gonna try to turn this desk around because I want it to face the other way. But also it's really heavy on its own and then it also has a lot of stuff in it. So hopefully I can do this without like breaking my back. I might as well vacuum while there's nothing over here. So I'm gonna vacuum, um, charge my camera put this away. I'm gonna put the cat in my mom's room so it doesn't get scared by the vacuum. And then I'll check back in with you. Cat, come say bye to the vlog. Say goodbye to the vlog, cat. I got my desk all turned around. Now I'm starting to just put things back where they belong. But I'm gonna put a room divider right here. That way I can lean my calendar up and stuff. But I think I'm gonna keep like my little camera set up right here because I think that's cute. Thought that it'd be fast, but it wasn't. You thought that it would last, but I didn't. Then I did it, yeah I did it I started catching feels for you I, I started catching feels for you I, I started catching feels for you I, I, I I moved this stuff over here But I think I'm gonna make like a little gallery wall With the, all this stuff Because I usually have it on top of this bookshelf But I actually put a lot of books on top of here To like fill that empty space but I moved this blue bookcase over here and I'm using it kind of as a shoe shelf and then once I put my room divider in here I'm gonna put coat hook things on that so I can hang my coat and my shoes like all together I feel like the next logical step would to be to fix my bed because I can't put my stuff in my closets right now because the cat's here and the cat doesn't really want to leave because look at him he's just straight chilling hey Um, do you want screen time? What? What is it? Oh, hello. I did not know I was recording. Peanut's here now. Say hey. I think she's mad at me because I let the cat in here. I brought the cat back out of my mom's room because, I don't know, Peanut is scared of the cat, so I don't want anything to happen out of retaliation from her, so... It's just gonna be me and Peanut hanging out now. You know, me and my BFF. Me and Peanut are gonna fix my bed, right, Bose? Come on, help me. Come here, help me. Please help me, please help me. Take my money, get off of my bed, thank you very much. Oh no, where's Peanut? Where is Peanut? She's gone. <laughs> I don't know where she went. Peanut! Peanut! <gasps> there you are! My good girl. See, she helped me take my blankets off, just like I said she would. I've done this before where I took my mattress off, and this is going to be an experience, so stay tuned for this quality content. Ugh. I want to see, I have this habit of stuffing clothes in the side of my bed in my sleep. There's nothing there, so that's good. Like if I have a shirt and I just like put it on my bed and then I'm going to sleep, I just put it in the crevice between my bed and the wall instead of actually taking care of it like a normal person. So I guess you could say to some degree I am still a psychopath, but I hope you guys are willing to look past that to subscribe to my channel. I'm gonna try to put my mattress on without messing up my little DIY bed skirt because if it if the mattress pushes the right way 
Tina, can I help you? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I think that actually worked out really well. Look who came to join the party! <laughs> Never mind, she's leaving. How does that look? I think that looks pretty good. Okay, hi. It's been probably three weeks since the last clip in this video because last time I filmed was also like the day before I found out I'm actually moving. Are you shocked? Because I'm shocked. Anyway, I'm gonna do this area right now. This is the last area I have left besides like the middle bit of my room. That's like all stuff that needs to go into storage or like Goodwill or something. So basically I'm gonna do my gallery wall. I've always wanted to do a gallery wall. And I'm also watching YouTube in the background. Right now I'm watching Laura Norris's, I think that's her name. She goes to Bama. I'm watching her like Rush Week vlogs and stuff. I literally would never join a sorority. It's just really not my thing, but I love watching sorority videos. I don't know. Oh wait, what's your name again? Are you kidding me? This is the airport code for Portland uh, Jetport in Maine, where I'm from. And I got this at LL Bean. I have this map of full. That map of full sent out to me is very kind of them. Thank you, map of full. You can have any any location you want in a little poster. So. I don't know where I'm gonna put this, to be honest. I was gonna put it on this side, but it's too big. Oh no, I got a big wooden. Ugh. DIY hammer. Take your pure leaf bottle. I have about three of them. We all know how I feel about pure leaf, so I have a bunch of these empties. Um, I'm gonna use it as a hammer, so I hope you enjoy this. Oh, that's not working at all. This is a picture of Westminster in London. And if you didn't know, I study abroad there. But I, this isn't mine, this was my mom's. And she told me this is from her first apartment. And I think that's really weird because she had never been to London until she came to visit me and never like had any interest in London. It just was like in her apartment and she somehow kept it. This is a watercolor painting I got in Salzburg, Austria. I think I got this one the first time I went to Paris and then the one I got when I went to Paris last May I gave to my best friend Courtney for her dorm room. Ow! This is where I'm gonna put my map of fall because I feel like over here it's more like tans and blues but then I have this black frame and I have like a little bit of black like in the little artwork so I feel like Putting this on this wall will still make it match without making it look like it's out of place, you know? So. Um, these paper plate awards, I don't know if they do them at like other schools, but in high, my high school, we did the paper plate awards. They're kind of like superlatives for the theater department. This one's from 2015. It's the Budding Star Award. It's from my sophomore year, which was my first year doing um, TA players, which was the like drama club at my school. And then this one is called, I went to Paris and lost my identity award because if you didn't know, I lost my everything, all forms of ID and wallet, money, all of that stuff. I lost that when I went to Paris my senior year. So you know what? I don't have them for my junior year. I guess I didn't go. We get senior plates from our director and he writes a really nice, like kind of like yearbook entry on them. So then the plastic one, is from our baccalaureate night, which is like senior awards night basically. So you get a plastic plate when you graduate, which I think that's really cute, so. Aw, that looks cute. That looks good. And then, okay, last thing I'm gonna hang up is gonna go right in this little space right here. This is um, part of my best friend Courtney's tail light because she backed into a tree in our driveway one time and this literally fell out of her car, it was so funny. It's in, I think, one of my birthday vlogs actually, what her car looked like, she like duct taped it back together, it's so funny, but this fell out in my yard and I, for some reason, kept it. But that's my gallery wall. Oh my gosh, this is literally the cutest thing ever. I've always wanted to do this. I'm feeling really into you, it's not like I wanted to, but I just wanna be with you tonight. Like, oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm used to fly.
flying solo, solo, solo I'm in trouble now, I'm in trouble now I'm singing like Ooh la 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 Take a part of me, take my heart, make it ours, we can let it be. Hold me in your arms.